these things shall be dissolved, what kind of people should you be? What kind of person should you be? You ought to be different in your way of life. The word holy comes from a root word to mean to be different. We can try to dress the same and drive the same kind of cars and live in the same neighborhood and like people to think that we're pretty much the same as they are, just sort of a regular guy. We're not the same. We have a different home, a different hope, a different life, a different purpose. Everything about us is different, you know. It doesn't mean that you try to be different. You are different. And if your heart is set on heaven, as you move through life, people will know you're different. In other words, people ought to know I'm different by the way I spend my money and the jokes I laugh at and the way I drive my car and the clothes I wear. There ought to be a difference. They're not just the, the things I spout, but my manner of life ought to say something. How I react under pressure, how I treat my boss. In every area of life, there ought to be a difference. I've told you maybe the story before. Some of you know Dr. Brian Pockroy in Haifa, in Israel. He had been raised to hate the name of the Lord Jesus. But he saw something in this woman, a, a midwifery student on their staff in South Africa, and he didn't know what it was. And he sat down across from her in the cafeteria one day, and he said, everything I do to be happy, you don't do. And you're happy and I'm not. Could you explain that to me? And he said, she gave me a one-word answer, and I hated it. She just said, Jesus. He said, I couldn't argue. And he went and got a Bible and went to his room. He said, I was visibly shaking as I opened the Bible and I began to read the New Testament. And I fell in love with the Lord Jesus. There's something different about that man now. He can sense it. And, and we have the privilege, when people see it, to tell them that it's the Lord Jesus who's made the difference. What a tremendous privilege we have living in this world to seek for the Savior. You're holy, you're different, but you're a Christian, and you love the Lord Jesus.